Hi guys, it's Caitlin and welcome back to Kenyon's Health Talk Gymnast. And this is You Know You're a Gymnast When. But before we get started, please subscribe to my channel as I am trying to get to 180 subscribers by the end of May. So if you can help me reach my goal, that would be amazing. But without any further ado, let's get started. You know you're a gymnast when you point your toes whatever you're doing. You know you're a gymnast when your explore page is full of gymnastics. Even if you refresh it multiple times, it will still be full of gymnastics. You know you're a gymnast when you leap across the streets like you get told multiple times to stop but you just keep like dancing and you just can't help it and people say walk properly but it's just like I just can't it's not possible for me like it's so hard to walk normally for some reason but like tons of people do it but as a gymnast it's just so hard and I can't walk normally You know you're a gymnast when none of your friends understand you because you're always speaking about gymnastics and they'll be so confused about what you're speaking about and yeah it's actually quite funny to see them react to me speaking about gymnastics. Um, hi Caitlin, what did you get up to at the weekend? I did like some gymnastics, like front walkovers, back walkovers. Oh right, back walkovers and front walkovers, seems fun. Yeah, they're really fun. I really like them. Alright. Do you even know what I'm talking about? No, sorry. Oh, never mind. You just don't understand gymnastics terms. You know you're a gymnast when you pick up stuff or open stuff with your feet. I've opened many doors with my feet before, picked up so many things that I've dropped on the floor with my feet. And it's just so natural. Like... It's just like as if you were picking something up with your hand or opening something with your hand. It's just like this is simple. And I have know so many people who are gymnasts who have done this. And it's just so natural for us to do. So yeah. <laughs> The next thing is you're the shortest one in your friend group or in your class. Like whenever you get told to line up in height order for like assemblies or something like when you're presenting assemblies in your class and stuff then you're like always at the end because of how small you are like concerts that we've done because of my height I've always been like at the front and that also means that in like concerts and stuff you have to sit on the floor and they don't give you a bench because you're too short the next thing is you get calluses or rips in your feet and hands and this is just from constantly being on your feet using your feet using your hands like yeah skip to this time if you don't like seeing like 
weird feet, <laughs> basically, because that's what I have because of calluses and stuff. You know you're a gymnast when you're comfortable sitting in splits or straddle for a long time and it just won't hurt because you're just so used to it and you can even like move around staying in splits or in a straddle. You know you're a gymnast when your bones are always cracking. And lastly, you know you're a gymnast when you're watching this video. Bye guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and share. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!